Oh. All right, guys. Day one, week one, fatality program that I have uh, basically built. Um, it's out. So if you are interested in getting this program, uh, email me, which uh, the email will be in the link below. Um, I'm going to be throwing these up casually. Uh, I can't do every fatality uh, workout that's in the program due to the fact that then I'm just giving it to everybody for free. But um, it's eight weeks of hell is what I can tell you. Um, it's progressive. Each week gets worse. Um, so today I'm going to do day one, week one, which is chest. Tons and tons of supersets and a lot of free weights. There are no cable machines um, in this. It's all free weight stuff for this whole week, actually. So we got chest. Taking some ape shit, basal gorge uh, today. Mix it up a little bit. Uh, ape shit, to me, it has a little bit more focus than uh, the Mega Pre Black. Um, maybe I'm wrong, but for some reason, I feel like I get a lot more focus and a lot more energy off of ape shit. Um, I love this stuff. It's a little bit more lower key than the um, Mega Pre Black. The pumps are still pretty intense. The caffeine is still pretty good. Um, and then just to increase the pumps a little bit more, always, oh, which we're getting low, uh, the basal gorge for just increased blood flow, which is what we want during this. Um, this is a very, like I said, high volume style of training. So uh, we need all the fucking pumps, all the fucking blood, uh, so we can break these muscles down and uh, regrow them. Let's get to work. these you guys make sure you're uh, increasing the weight you know the first one you're not gonna try to like max yourself out max 12 reps you got four sets so increase your weight if you get to a point where you're used, you know you might struggle on your four, third or fourth set maybe go down maybe go up depending on where you're sitting at but manage yourself intensity is key here so that's the first one already kind of got like a nice little pump going it's only 24 reps so we got a ways to go All right, so we're gonna move over to the second working set over here, which is uh, bench press and uh, dumbbell pullovers. Now, when you look at this workout, don't mix and match and do certain areas where you feel the need that you just want to do them at. There's a reason why bench press is coming after all this uh, volume over here. When you get up on here, you're gonna feel that the bar path's a little different. You gotta control and stabilize a little bit more to control the weight both ways because you got such a crazy pump going right now, a lot of control is gonna come into play, which therefore, we're really gonna be targeting some good stabilizing muscles right now. So, don't fucking mix and match. Don't do what you want. Go in the order that is in, it's there for a reason. Also, 
you know, uh, I have over a 400 pound bench. As you can see, I'm starting out with 250 for the first set of 12. Don't get cocky and try to come in here and lift heavy because you're not going to be able to get what you usually can get, especially after doing all the, all the reps that we just did over here. And we got four sets of 12 over here of super setting. So it's about volume. It's not about weight. Not yet anyway, guys. So push through the workout, do what you're supposed to do, follow it. And I guarantee you by the end of this workout, you're going to be hurting. Oh, you guys, one more. So you guys see, failed that last rep. That's okay. Stood up, laid back down, still got the rep. Even if you have to drop the weight to get the reps in, that's okay. So from here, two more sets. Rep work is the most important right now, not weight. So put the ego aside, drop some weight on your next set so you can get good 12 reps. But we will go up on the uh, the dumbbell pullover because we're doing those pretty decently. So we'll drop down about 10 pounds and uh, hit that third set. That's what this shit's about right there. push up <laughs> very high incline and it is on a smith machine but what it's allowing me to do is i have such a crazy chest pump right now and when i come down this incline i'm resting it on my chest for three seconds causing this massive stretch in my chest really stretching the muscles and as you can see we're just we're starting to get after one set a very big upper chest pump and you'll start feeling it right when you do this it's good shit Thing. So go ahead and get offended by this uh, 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 uh. Oh, 
<laughs> Who wrote this fucking program up? Oh. Oh. What an idiot. Either a dumb motherfucker or a crazy motherfucker wrote this shit up. But the pump. Let's get in there. It's only workout number only workout number three. We got two more motherfuckers to go. Shit. Alright guys. Set number three of four. Got my boy. Rob Bailey in the tunes, Song Destroy. So I feel like it's fucking perfect for this right now. Push it on this last set. We're gonna push it. Come on. Two more shit, two more things to do, fuck. You gotta really love this shit to want to do this shit. You don't got to be the biggest, baddest motherfucker. You just gotta want to fucking eat, man. You just gotta love this shit. Why is only one leg sweating? <laughs> we only got sweat on one leg. <laughs> Come on, motherfucker. <sighs> Uh. 
Okay. I want these motherfuckers right here. Jumped up 10 fucking pounds from the last set. I can't do 95s, man. I want them hundos. I don't care if I get two reps each fucking time. I'm getting 12. I'm getting 12. If I have to stay here for an hour, I'm getting 12. I want these motherfuckers. Come on. Come on. One more. One more. Come on, one more, motherfucker. Come on. There it is. I'm not gonna be one of those motherfuckers. Right? Uh, right out program. I need to do shit. A lot of people like that. Uh. Last one. Two ten, guys. Last one! Ah. Fatality, motherfuckers. I hope you're all are ready. We got eight weeks of destruction coming. And it just gets harder. I can't fucking wait. Good shit, y'all. <laughs>